Hey up everyone, it's the Expander, and we are back on Better Minecraft. Now, if you've caught the last stream, we've done a little bit of building work. So, things are looking a little bit nicer, but we've still got quite a ways to go before we're all built up properly. Uh, plot a bunch of these mega torches down. So I think we've got, you see the little gold squares on the map there, there, there. Just to give this a nice wide area where there's no mobs so that don't have any nasty creepers creeping up and blowing my base up. Um, as for this, working wonderfully at getting food, which reminds me. Make sure we've got more food. We've got potatoes coming in slowly, but coming in nonetheless from this guy. And our villager breeder works very well. Uh, so much so, that is absolutely rammed. Uh, did have to wall off the beds, because some of the villagers from that village over there started coming and trying to sleep here. Which, just, no. This didn't quite work. Still haven't gone and fixed anything yet or changed it gonna have to do a bit of thinking and rejigging um, we did get built the spawning platform so this is where I'm gonna put a couple of mob spawners for various things we need to farm like blazers or if I can get a wither skeleton spawner brilliant for wither skulls and this one which has a piglin brute spawner from the mushroom village so I can just stand here let this fill up a little bit go ahead and kill everything and my backpack will pull everything in this is a brilliant source of gold iron golden carrots these acts of rectitude which I can't really do anything with so I want to be scrapping them because I've got uh, well, let's show you. I have got chest full, crate full, chest half full, and another chest with <laughs> loads in. I am getting so many of these, so what I'm going to have to do is build a, a trash bin. Whether I do a fire again, or whether I do a cactus, don't know. Gonna have to figure that bit out, but uh, yeah, everything else is running smoothly. So on the stream, uh, we did do a little bit of exploring as well. Um, oh no, after the stream, sorry, did a little bit of exploring. Did find something that was wonderful, absolutely wonderful. So. Um, we found a load of illager mine full of books. So, eight books of mending left, eight books of unbreaking, nine efficiency. I say left because we've got a pickaxe, an axe with mending, we have shovel with unbreaking and silk touch, silk touch efficiency, pickaxe, uh, silk touch axe. So, pretty much a full range of tools that we can use. And the other thing I found was that bad boy. A tower full of villagers and goodies. So today let's go hunting. Oh yeah, all my armor's on breaking three and mending. <laughs> uh, I do really ought to get some level ups and put the protections on there as well. Uh, which, to be honest, I think we'll do now. Uh, I've definitely had enough experience of getting close to dying. I mean, I've died more times than I care to admit. So, where are we? Sharpness 4, what's there on it? Sharpness 2, ooh, might as well get that on there. 
Fortune 3, what's going on it? Fortune 3. Does Fortune go up any higher than 3? Max level 3. No. Look at you, Bat. Uh, right. So, I know I picked up a bunch of armour that got prop 2 on it. The 3. Let's get them off. Uh, let's get the books. Get some more books. So, my sword is going to need five levels and each of these is going to need that's six, five, five. So, about 20 levels. So, let's go over to our spawner here. Sit here and see how long it takes us to get to about 21 levels. So we're around about 3 minutes and I'm at 19. So there's definitely faster ways of getting levels. But four more golden carrots, a couple more ingots. Really should build my uh, enchanting, bring some enchanting stuff over here as well. Get an enchant, uh, enchanting table, me grindstone, me anvil, uh, chest full of enchanted books. Turn this into the enchanting room as well. But come on, another round of these, and I should have enough. There we go. Twenty-one levels. So let's get back and. Sew it up. So that, oh, that with the sharpness, that with one protection, that with protection, that with protection. So much better. Right. Now let's go and tackle the Silager Tower. So I have no idea what's at the top of this. I did go up a couple of levels just to see what it was like, and it is chock full of loot. So it's definitely going to be a uh, profitable run. Ooh. Oh. Got our backpack as well feeding us. Oh. Well, that Enderman's gone and done a runner. Oh well. So let's see, so this is pretty big on the map. Can't miss it. Does have an entrance, which I can't miss. And yeah, it's <laughs> Spawn right next to a spider cave. There you are, Mr. Enderman. So I may have to raid the spider cave as well when I'm done. But yeah. This is what it's like, so I'm just going to quickly nab a few things. I might take those for decorations. And let's go. So the first floor. Well, once we get up the stairs. A couple of chests of goodies. And that wall of just sheer lunacy. There is more spawners. There was a spawner back here as well that I took out. And it looks like there's another one here somewhere. I don't know where. But, let's get our Vermine Fortune pick. Get some of these. Yeah, aquatite. There's emerald. There's redstone, gold. 
Copper Moonstone. Experience. Horizonite. All sorts of stuff here. So, it looks like it's pulled from I mean, stuff from blue skies, stuff from biomes, cliffs and skies. Uh, caves and cliffs, even. I mean, let's have a quick look at what that came with. Uh, oh, in fact, you know what? I forgot to turn to my backpack after killing those things. There we go. There. So, penderite, copper, gold, iron, lapis, diamonds, emeralds, nether quartz, redstone, amitrine gems, pyrope gemstones, moonstone shards, Anthracite, Emeraldite, so four Pindorite, Emeraldite, and two Emeralds make a Pindorite ingot, which gives me some decent upgrade on my swords. Hmm. Uh, what was the stuff the other? These Amatrite gems, making very Shiny horse armor. So pyropes like it's blue skies or uh, moonstone. Oh, this is some of the stuff that's for. I mean, you need one of those to light the portal. Making spears. Mm, some rather funky stuff. Uh, let's get rid of these. Purple Bulbous Oddity. Blue Grush will keep them ones. Oh, some odds here that didn't actually break as well. All the Blue Sky stuff. And more... Gemstones here. So, I mean, that sword, 9 and 1.2. Better than that when it's unenchanted. So, yeah. Lignite. Is this just cold replacement? Yeah. Uh, oh, that's so funky. I'll take the arrows as well. Okay. That's cool. Right, next level was just full of different trees. Planks. Probably where that other spawner is, but... Whoa! Hello! This was the archery range. This is now as far as I got. Three guesses where that spawner is. You can go. A bunch of arrows. Right, this, whole new territory. Next floor, we've got, oh dear, necromancers. And solar fish. I'm guessing it's coming from you. Right. Spawner back here. Silverfish spawner at that. Two silverfish spawners. And the enchanter spawner. <laughs> Lapis blocks. Yes, please. Uh, oh, we'll take the iron ingots. We'll take the enchanting table. Did we get. We ought to put vein mining on one of these. Although, to be fair, with efficiency 3, this does chop rather quickly. Right. Oh dear. Great. Evokers summon these things, and with an evoker, 
they're a little more on the annoying side. Indicators. Boy, these things hurt. Oh, gee, mama. Right, uh. Don't think we're gonna need the shovel soon, so let's. Golden carrot, right. Let's. Yeah, keep you on for a minute, but I'm gonna have to keep the golden carrots handy. And. Um, Let's keep that one out because I might use that. Right. Ooh, blaze rod. Very nice. I'll take the rest of while I'm at it. Right. Knock, knock. <laughs> Gastias. Always a yes. Knock, knock again. Oh, nothing in that one. Right, next floor. Oh, another arch room. Right, let's get the uh, spawner from back here. Unbreaking a nutmack. Yes, please. Some more arrows. behind there. Right, next floor we've, ooh, ooh, this looks like I'm out of the top. Oh, gee, that is a big dude. Illager King. Oh, sorry King, you've just been dethroned. Oh, well, we're going to need more decorations, so all of those can come down. Redstone, coal, lapis. Might pinch these redstone lamps as well. Oh, this is a fruitful. Uh, yeah, we'll take all them. Yes, we'll take all them. Water breathing. Liquid look, yes, we'll take those. More blaze rods, yes, we'll take those. Well, this most certainly was fruitful, but. <laughs> oh, oh, man. I mean, is that that's really the top, isn't it? Ah. Oh. Kind of hope for more levels, <laughs> but that was very nice. Ow! 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 <sighs> yeah, I can see the window there. Very, very tippy top. That. Oh, nice. More of those, please. Definitely more of those, please. Very much like that. Uh, let's go grab our... Ow. Warp's done. Although, before I do... Is there anything underneath? Because we've got stone here. No. Worth a check. I didn't want there to be some basement there full of goodies that I'm going to miss. Right, where's my waist on? I know it's around here somewhere. There you are. 
Right, that is very good. Also gives me confidence that I am much stronger than I give myself credit for. Might mean some of the more difficult dungeons won't be as hard as you think. I might have a stab at the Thornborn Towers at some point. I might do that in a live stream. So we'll keep this, keep watching this space. Speaking of the live streams, they are up on YouTube as well. So if you're not going and catch them, uh, just look. I will be sticking them all in their own playlist. So they'll be in date order. But there's going to be definitely plenty of streams. That is a that is a whale. <laughs> that is a really big fish. That is a whale. That is cool. That is very cool. I mean, it's huge, but that is cool. Right. Oh, cabbage seeds. Oh, cabbage. cabbage is such a pain in the backside to find seeds for. So it does look like, I mean I've got rid of my waste stone, but it does look like I've uh, reached the top of the land here. I uh, don't fancy jumping into a boat just yet. Right. Oh, sorry. Yeah, forget this sword. When you hit anything, it attacks things around. It damages things around it. So you actually like sweeping edge, but you don't need sweeping hedge to hit the things around you. It just does damage. It does like an area effect. This sword is brilliant, and I know I want to pick up things that do more damage later, but for now. This is my mighty chopper, and I'm sticking with it. Right. Back in a mo, if I find anything in interesting. That just looks very peculiar. Ooh, actually, there is something interesting we could take a look at. Pop you down. Um... We've got this place. Well, not this, because this is just a hut. But this down here. So I noticed this. I thought, this looks very strange. And as I dropped into it, I got an achievement for finding the, found the foundry. Which, when I did look in here, was full of piglins. These are... Whoa! Yikes, they are tough. Whoa! Right. Please don't spawn anything. Salt, gold. Oh, you spawned! I said, please don't spawn. Dag, nab it, they hurt. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, this is going to be fun. <laughs> um. Well. Let's do this first. Let's see if we can run, grab, transfer, run. Run away, run away, run away. Okay. 
You know that that I said about feeling a little bit more confident about fating some of these other dungeons. That does not include this one. Jeez. That's the right one, yes. Right, I have a new plan. I need some blocks. We are going to brave this dungeon. We are going to brave this dungeon. We're going to conquer some of it. But first things first, I need some cobble. What we can do is just wall in any of the uh, more obnoxious pigmen. I'm a bow. Right, foundry take two. So, we've robbed that chest, so we don't need you. Gotcha. Okay, one down. Right, two down. Oh no 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 not too down not too down there we go oh okay what we got blackstone nice golden apple oh debris miners I mean these don't drop they drop netherite armor the netherite picks oh gee mama okay one of these spawners back worth pinching um, Gonna be a pain in the backside to get. Tier of Vexes. Oh. oh got two totems went dying as well. Uh, yeah, could have done with keeping one of those in my inventory ten minutes ago. Five minutes ago. However many minutes ago. Oh, might have to pinch one of these spawners. Find a passive way of I could. Right. Definitely gonna keep this place here marked because. I have got to wait how I can get these to spawn and take damage. Oh, gee. Blackstone. Oh dear. Oh, 
Okay, so this place is full of obsidian as well. But oh, gee, did you translations on a postcard, please? Oh, that was close. I might have had a mild heart attack there. So, block that off as well, and block that off as well, right. Just boot. No, it's dropping netherite. Trash plates as well. I wonder if it'll drop all the armor by the time it's done. Okay. Oh, taking all that off and dumping it on that netherite pickaxe. Oh, yes. Grey bucket, ether dragon egg, blackstone, enchanted golden carrots. Ooh, we'll have those any day. That looks like part of the foundry, but that also looks terrifying. Alright, no piglins with both, please. Yeah, this definitely looks like the uh, the centre. Okay. Now, now, pray tell. What do we have here? There's dispensers. Nothing in them. All that down there intrigues me as well. Right, these can't get over the walls. As long as I block off where the levers are. Because it can get over these. Oh. Don't even think about it. Right, is this going to be a terrible idea? This is Blackstone. Oh yes, that would have been a terrible idea. That would have been a terrible idea indeed. There is more spawners down there. How did you get in? Never mind that. Go away. Oh, this is scary on so many levels. Right. Oh my god. I must be going out of my mind. of spawners. I have no idea what these spawners are going to kick out. 
that is a humongous never well broken humongous never pole. As is that. No pigglings with bows, please no pigglings with bows. I am terrified. I, I genuinely am. This is a, a, an amazing structure, but oh, it's full of blade spawners. Oh, you s absolutely didn't do that. Oh, you. You are jesting me. Okay. This is the most horrific place I can think of being right now. Giant magma cubes, I can deal with you. Blazers, no. Right, oh, wrong that, wrong pick, wrong pick, wrong pick. Uh, oh shoot. Right. I'll have you for experience though, because I've done it again. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, mama, oh dear. Ow. Don't, oh jeez, it's burning down the trees. Right, so, in a scale of 1 to 10 of bad ideas, this is pretty much up there. Um, and I do not have a, um, oh yeah. And things with bows. <laughs> oh, what a royal mess you've got yourself in here. Okay. Um. I need to somehow get out of here. Oh! <laughs> On a scale of one to dead, how screwed are you right now? Uh... About a comfortable 20. Right. So, I'm going to make my way out of here and hopefully not get killed by any of the menagerie of absolute horrors that are down here. Oh my, I've just looked at them, seen the mini map. This place is huge. Okay. I am going to have to come back here when I am wholly more prepared 
for taking out things that are vastly more powerful than I am. And blazers. <laughs> All those things. Oh, jeez. Right, let's... Oh, don't run out of... Um, this had some bottles of experience in it. I did pick some up. Right, six of them. I'll do. Well, I should repair that a little bit at least. Don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break. Dag nab it. Well and truly stuck under this, aren't I? <laughs> okay, I think I'm losing it. Right, I want to call it here, guys. Um, whilst I try to get out of this mess that I've got myself in. Uh, yeah, I want to get out of this mess. I want to get back to base. I want to get a waystone down. Wherever this staircase comes out, I'm going to build put a waste on the waste on there so I can easily come back and we can try and explore here. But this is just an absolute nightmare. Oh. In the meantime, guys, you all take it steady. I was in the garden. Comment away about how much of a buffoon I am or how bad a mistake I've just made. Hit, if you like it, hit the like button. If you subscribe, please do. It means world and it helps me no end. And yeah, um, catch the link down below if you want to check out the panda, Yorkshire Panda Tees, which are hand drawn by myself and my sprinted, so nothing like it. And. Yeah, catch the streams. Um, I'll be trying to stream a couple of times a week. Not got a proper schedule at the minute. So just hit subscribe, hit the notification bell, and whenever I'm streaming, it'll ping you, and you can always catch me and talk to me there. But you guys take it steady. Ever since I got in, I'll catch you later. Bye-bye.